for TraderInsight.com. I'm Adrian Manns, and let's have a review of Friday's trading plan results. First off, we did not have much going on during the Friday session at all. The only thing from the regular portion of the trading plan, from the core portion of the plan that triggered, was SWN, Southwestern Energy Company. And we see here that that one just tagged us in and then unfortunately reversed and stopped us out for the full stop. Nothing terrible, just down 34 cents per share on that one. And of course, none of the stocks to watch ever triggered over the course of the session, and we didn't have any radar setups. As far as the scalper trades go, we had Apple trigger right off the opening bell. This was a nice one. And if you had an order out there, as we often do for scalper, because this one is a uh, very volatile stock right in the morning, and it tends to move between those bands when the futures are pointing in the right direction and the stock gets opened at the right price. And in this case, it got opened right above 93.54 triggered immediately got in and got back out again at 93.24 that's a pickup of 30 cents a share came back up reversed made this move higher right and that is that switch hitter kind of a pullback even though it doesn't look like it on a five minute chart right if we bump this time frame out to a one minute it makes it quite a bit easier to see we had this pullback got up above here nice double header kind of kings and queens set up also a switch hitter pullback right nice and deep Gets back down, triggers in 93.54 again, and another move down to $93.24. Back out on the five minute, it is conceivable that you picked it up a third time at the 93.54 resting entry. I do not like those kind of entries very much early in the session. I choose to do those later in the session only. So for Apple Computer, nice 60 cent per share gain on the first two entries of the morning. 30 cents per share if you waited out the first five minutes and only took the second. And now let's take a look at Metivation Incorporated. This one's ticker symbol MDVN. We have a nice deep pullback. Double header kings and queens. Kind of a reversal here. It gets back down. 69.87. Look how wide this target is. 69.87 down to 69.43. So we've got a 44 cent per share target. When it gets down within 10 cents of that target, it's time to ratchet stops down and give yourself the opportunity to take some money off the table, right? So all you boot camp guys, all you ITA guys, you should have immediately pulled down to 69.65 or so. You can just eyeball it. You don't have to have an exact resting point for a 50% to target move. I guess it would actually be kind of closer to here. But uh, 69.63, 69.65, somewhere in there. Take some of those shares off. Lock in that 23 cent per share gain and look for another opportunity. Unfortunately, on this one, MDVN, we did not get a second entry opportunity. It never came up and gave us a pattern entry back through the 6987 line. It never traveled down low enough to trigger any of the other levels. So not bad. If all you traded on Friday were the scalper setups, you walked away with about 80 cents per share. That is nothing to sneeze at. 34 cents of that went away with the SWN trade, but that's trading, right? You're not going to win every single time. The important thing is you get the odds in your favor. If you have any questions, shoot me an email, adrian at traderinsight.com. I hope you had a great trading day on Friday and an even better one coming up on Monday. The best trader education anywhere, only at traderinsight.com.